Hey everybody, all right, so this past week I was uh, fortunate enough to go to a stand-up comedy show, his name's Shane Gillis, um, absolutely hilarious in my opinion, he's like number one, number two, um, active comedians right now as far as just like, just a beautiful set, just we were laughing the whole time, and he had some openers as well, they weren't as good, but they were pretty dang good overall, and what I thought was interesting was, you know, they'd go in there and you could tell like they were working on some jokes where they weren't exactly crisp yet, they didn't have all the details worked out, they were essentially trying out new material, and some of them bombed and I thought about like in the real estate world what that looks like as well like it's not as scary because you don't have like a huge audience but we do have to go out in the field sometimes and just bomb especially when you're newer like you don't know what you're doing yet you know hopefully you have a mentor or a team or a broker that's helping you coaching you guiding you but ultimately at the end of the day they can't be everywhere and sometimes you got to go out there you got to make your phone calls you got to go show homes you got to go on listing appointments and sometimes you bomb and that's okay, because what happens is you always get better. I can't tell you how many times I've bombed, and I continue to bomb, but every time I take that bomb and I improve upon it, I get better, I figure out where I can grow. It's like, that was embarrassing. Okay, maybe I'll adjust this, or maybe I'll try to do this instead of that, and just see, and, just, and then you just kind of analyze things and see where you can improve. But it's okay, and I think a lot of us get scared, the fact that you know we consider bombing failing, and it's not. It's only a failure if you stop, but you gotta keep going out there you got to be like a comedian and don't be afraid because that's ultimately what they have to do in order to make the set perfect. Like you can't just rely on what's in your head because the audience's reaction might be entirely different. So you physically have to go out on the stage. You have to try material. And sometimes the way you think it works doesn't. And the audience will let you know. So you have to almost intentionally go out and bomb so the public can give you honest critique and feedback. Same thing in real estate. Sometimes you just got to go out and bomb and heck, it didn't work back to the drawing board. You refine it. You get better. You make the adjustments and you perfect your craft. So go out there and bomb.